We will now recognize the number one personal producer in both the Worksite Marketing Division and the Consumer Marketing Division. We will begin with the WMD. Our 2017 WMD Producer of the Year has a very long and distinguished career in our industry and with our company. Prior to joining PMA's predecessor company in 1990, he spent nearly nine years at Combined Insurance Company learning that whatever the mind can conceive and believe, it can achieve. W. Clement Stone. Having been a part of PMA since its inception, his list of achievements are truly too many to mention, but a few highlights include, in 2001, he became the first producer in PMA history to surpass the $500,000 plateau in personal production in one year and held that all-time personal production record in this company for over six years. He has served at every level in the organization, including state manager, and is a back-to-back -back repeat winner as producer of the year, having won in 2016 as well. In 2017, the legend continued as he turned in a record day of over 11,000 in premium, a record week of over 25,000, and turned in his best quarter in Q4 with nearly 130,000 in premium finishing the year with a very impressive $470,000 in net annualized premium. Ladies and gentlemen, joined by his lovely wife and inspiration karma, please welcome to the stage one of the most prolific producers in the history of the WMD with nearly $4.5 million in lifetime sales and the 2016 and 2017 repeat top producer of the year Mr. Kevin Schultz. Wow. The sales gods had a sense of humor. Number one producer, and not one quarter did I achieve number one. And this just hit me as I was listening to a lot of the accomplishments. I was not even number one agent ever in a week last year. However, when you use this system, you go to market, it produces results, week in, week out, month in, and month out. And if there's anything, if I'm before you, that would be a testament to the power of what PMA has given each and every one of us. So thank you, PMA. For, before I share some ideas on this wonderful achievement and honor, I want to thank God for all his blessings. And his, <laughs> and I want a special thank you to Karma for her ongoing love and support through the many long weeks that I'm away, especially last year in August. We lost her mom. And she allowed me to go back to work, and it was really difficult. I love you, baby. But as a burning desire to achieve, this was really the focus. So she is such a treasure to watch every day as she quietly stands by my side, supporting and loving me in her own special way. But finally, and get a load of this PMA, finally, after two annual awards, finally, I get out of the United States to go on a European trip. <laughs> Thank you, PMA. <laughs> Couldn't resist that. Frequently I'm asked, how I do this? How do I stay motivated? How do I keep doing this after 28 years? Well, here's a few things, just a few. 
set a goal. I mean, it's in the playbook. Our goal was set early on, and I was reminded by Karma that she took a picture of me walking in the San Francisco airport with a piece of luggage saying we're off to Switzerland. And she just shared that with me uh, yesterday, and I'm like, wow. But we talked a lot during the year, and I always put PSM on my daily five, program the subconscious mind. And for anybody that's around me, you're going to hear that till the cows come home. Visualize whatever you want to achieve. Carry a picture. I had a picture. I looked at the map of Switzerland every day, sometimes a myriad of times in a day. Again, program the subconscious mind. And I picked a song really early last year. I think I picked it probably right after we got back from Napa. I picked the song that I wanted to use when I came up. And I also envisioned the PMA Nation out here allowing me to share everything and the few things that I feel are important to achieve this. Number four, go the extra mile, Philo. Uh, you guys probably heard a few people shout that when I came up. Thanks to Joey Grimaldi. He gave me that nickname here not too long ago. But I do exemplify that. I work night shifts. You know, there's, there's no stopping me. I'm out there. And probably the one single surprise I had, and I don't know if Alex Hunt even remembers it, but he was with me when I got a call from an organization called the BEA, the Black Employees Association, saying, hey, are you still interested in partnering with us? And I'm like, well, let's talk. And that started a conversation which culminated in getting the largest group that I've ever gotten in my career, which is the state of California. And the beautiful thing about that is that it allows the gold rush, the PMA gold rush, many opportunities for many years to come, and we are still accessing departments that we have not even touched. So, I mean, that's a testament to the power of our worksite system and the teamwork that makes the dream work. And for that, I would like each and every person that wrote any applications in the BMA, BEA, to stand up right now. And finally, I have a little gist with a gentleman in the far back of the room I can't quite see with the lights on. His name is Mr. JT, Jimmy Tonko. We kind of have a little uh, kidding joke here. And my mentor, Gary Dovenberg, passed along something to me which was on a field training report that he had many years ago. And it's basically, did I change someone's life for the better? And for anyone that's had the opportunity of working aside of me or being field trained by me, I have some unique techniques in motivating one to what I call get on the A-team or the A-team's way because I truly believe that everybody should um, be at their very, very best. I don't care whether it's the presentation or inviting somebody into the opportunity for PMA, whether it's pointing during the presentation, if I see something that I feel would help them bring their game up, I will be all over them, and as I would say again, in somewhat unconventional methods. <laughs> so in closing, it's such an inspiration to be here. I mean, that 4.5 million, that is going to fall so quickly. There are so many rising stars in this room. There are so many things that PMA is putting on the plate with systems and opportunities for each and every one of us. That record will fall. It's going to get compressed. It'll get shorter and shorter and shorter. So my call to action for everybody in here, which kind of echoes Scotty last night, is let's get some mindsets around ourselves here to go for excellence. Could be excellence in a day and excellence in a week. But let's keep that mantra going, because truly, each and every person here has that inside of them. Thank you, PMA leadership, Scotty and Mike, Joey, Todd, and again, all of PMA Gold Rush. You are the best in America. Woo!